Hey guys, um, I can't talk for long, but I did want to check in. You know how the Lord told me I was a pirate. And then I went blind in my eye. And I'm also missing a tooth, guys. But, I mean, I have a fake tooth in in, in its place. But, um, you know, clearly I look like a pirate. Then I got the card that said, Yo-ho, hope. And what's the Lord been teaching right now? But to have hope. The blessed hope, right? The blessed hope. And so then the Lord had me with do all the words on the maps. And how I lived in a tabernacle, in the shape of a tabernacle, everywhere I went. So the Lord has declared, declares his people wherever they go, right? So he's been declaring it, right? Who I am. Well, the Lord just passed out a new anointing, right? I didn't know it was like considered an anointing, but, but then I figured it out. But, but it's the anointing of the Ark of the Covenant. But particularly for me and for other, there's others out there, guys. We're going to work as in unity as an army. But now the Lord's been working on me with maps. And I told you guys, Banquet Tennessee, and the Lord gave me a map. Right? And then I told you that the Jimmy the Fish was like a secret map. It was like a coded map. Like a legend to a map. That you need to be given by the Lord. Well, I'm so excited because... <laughs> you guys, we are, right? Alright, 144,000 God's people. Alright, too. Are gold. We are his treasure. His diadems, right? And in a dream, I went to a bank, but then I left and I had pearls and diamonds and diadems in my hands. Then I ascended up 15 stairs, which is us rising to meet him in the air, which is right now. We, this is what we're doing, right? Well, um, even further, you know how in my life, like I end up living out physically almost all my words, like Everything that I come out and say to you guys, like, it's because I've lived it out. You know, the Lord's, like, shown it to me through, like, or or I'll say something and then it does happen. Well, while we're God's army and we're bringing up people and we're, we're amassing a nation and we're changing the world. And we're bringing hope and freedom from bondage and Jesus Christ's name. While we're doing that, we need money, right? We need funds. Well, Hollister's been making money bags. <laughs> Tons of money bags, just like he did with the Among Us, okay? He's been making clay money bags. Like, why, why are you making money bags? Like, like handmade little money bags. How strange was that, right? And so I'm like, Lord, why is he making money bags? And then I got all these, I got these shirts that ended up coming with an extra one, made twin shirts that said Ireland on them and had the four leaf clover like good luck like provision and good luck and wealth and guess what the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow oh i just realized that <laughs> we are the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow well guess what the holy grail is you guys god's given me a map what what do pirates go out and do they hunt for treasure dude <laughs> but we need provision right the Lord has provided a way and deep, deep in history. You guys, I know, this might sound all fantastical, right? Sounds a little crazy. Sounds like, Cadence, come on now. You can't be thinking you're going to go out and be, and go out and find buried treasure. Oh, but as the Lord told you so. You guys, I'm so excited about this. It, it seems so crazy to me to even believe I can't believe I'm believing it <laughs> but I guess because I've, I've lived my own life right and I and I and I know what all the Lord's given me over time which has been just tons of little things like tons of little things that add up to a giant story that you understand because you lived it out so you know when the Lord says something to you over time after you followed the Lord long enough which has been seven years Plus, I believed in Jesus my whole life, okay? But I got really saved then. But when the Lord tells you, you, you know, because he, he'll, he'll tell you, and then, and then it's just a confirm to, like, everything else you've ever received. Well, then I was like, all right, Lord, this is getting a little fantastical over here. 
I need you to give me a scripture and I need it to be several. I need several scriptures, please. Like, please just show me through several, several scriptures that I'm not crazy because I have no provision. I'm, I'm not prepared. I, I've just trusted that the Lord has guided me. And if he wanted me to prepare in that way, he would have shown me that. But he's shown me that... But that, that, that's just not how I, I would have provision provided, okay? Um, and so, I just, I waited on the Lord. Well, then he gave me a scripture. So, let me go to the scripture. Let's see. I'm hoping I got it. I know I'm remembering it right. I should have looked beforehand, but I didn't that's okay okay what is my name but cadence hooper meaning new song a new song a rhythm right a new song and um <clears throat> my last name is hooper the weaver of the hoopa so weaving together something would be like bringing something together under one thing right but a covering. A hoopah is the covering that is over the people when they get married in the Jewish tradition. Okay. You guys, this is so cool. Okay. For the chief musician, a psalm of David. Man, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Praise you, Jesus. Okay. Uh, the, uh, his promises are the only thing that is, like, keeping me afloat right now, you guys. So, um... I'm not trying to sound prideful or anything. I'm just so excited. I'm so excited that we're going to be like Indiana Jones, man. We're going to be like an amassed army. Finding like hit things in history, man. Like, like, man. Oh, I love history too. <laughs> I love history. Okay, let me read this to you guys. So I'm going to have to read through it. Quite a bit. But um, but that's okay. Because we're getting God's word out, right? So, um, so just... Have good cheer and, and hold on and just, just stay afloat with me, right? Okay. The heavens declare the glory of God. The firmament showeth his handiwork. Now, this anointing is like, sounds like the Ark of the Covenant. And what, you, you couldn't touch the Ark of the Covenant. when Once this came down, you couldn't touch him. Okay, it's like, like how Elijah's face glowed. Glowed. That's like the ark anointing. Okay, there's like certain people you just can't. They're just, uh, I don't know, right? <laughs> I don't even know how, uh, how else to explain it. It's just, it's a big anointing. And it, it's, I believe it's for all the 144,000, but I'm, I'm unsure of that. I've only been shown two other people that have it. Um, I was shown that so that I could have like a comparison and understanding from the Lord. But um, uh, let, let me continue. The heavens declare the glory of God. The firmament showeth his handiwork. Day unto day uttereth speech. Night unto night showeth knowledge. There is no speech nor language. Their voice heard is heard not, is not heard. Their line has gone out through all the earth. And their words to the end of the world. Their line has gone out all through. The, their line has gone through all the earth and their words to the end of the world in them hath he set a tabernacle for the sun s-u-n which is as a bridegroom cometh out of his chamber you guys these are i think the lord and 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 i i came to this realization once sister darla had to tell me and then i was like oh that's exactly what's happening the books that were shut, that were closed up till a certain time, are open. And he's passing out the revelations to us, you guys. Oh, so cool. Okay. And rejoices as a strong man to run his course. His going forth is from the end of, is from the ends of the heavens, and his circuit unto the ends of it. Right? Like an athlete, okay? Sorry. <laughs> like an athlete. In his circuit unto the ends of it. And there is nothing hid from the heat thereof. What did I tell you guys? The Lord was like putting 
on my video he put to make hot to make hot and what do you do in a greenhouse but you get all these plants like super hot you got to make them hot and you put bricks in there to make them hot and then you put a covering over them so that they can like soak it in and like you know photosynthesis and all that okay the law of jehovah is perfect restoring the soul the testimony of jehovah is sure making wise the simple the precepts of Jehovah, Jehovah are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of Jehovah is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of Jehovah is clean, enduring forever. The ordinance of Jehovah are true and righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than fine gold, than, than gold, yea, than much fine gold. Sweeter also than honey and droppings of honeycomb. Moreover, by them is thy servant warned. And keeping them there is great reward. Who can discern his errors? Clear thou me from hidden faults. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous, presumptuous sins. Let them not have dominion over me. Then shall I be upright. Then shall I be clear from the, from the great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and med meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight. O Jehovah, my rock and my redeemer. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, wait, we got one more scripture. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, hold on, I spelled hidden wrong. Hold on, I know it's a song. I'm sorry guys, this other one is super important to the revelation. Um doo -doo -doo -doo. okay. Right, hold on guys, I'm so sorry. I should have found these ahead of time, but I kind of, um, I got excited and then I didn't, well, either way, we're going to, I'll show you this other one. Maybe it was nine. Hold on. I know it's like, um, okay. Alright guys, I'm guessing maybe I'm not going to find it. Dang it. I might be on a different... Let me see, one more thing for you guys. Because this, it was so perfect. It was so perfect. Um, I know it was from David. And um, it was to the chief musician. Okay, here. There's more. Okay, now, it's in the message version. version. So, if you're um, 
against that, okay. But, um, this is what I had seen it on, so, uh, which I don't normally read this, but it's, it's been switching over lately, like, um, I don't know, since they updated, it stays on there, and sometimes I just read on that one, you know, just quickly, but, um, okay, there's more. God's word warns us of danger and directs us to hidden treasure. Otherwise, how will we find our way or know when we play the fool? Clean the slate, God, oh, we can start f start the day fresh. Keep me from stupid sins, from thinking I can take over your work. Then I can start the day sun washed, scrubbed clean of the grime of sin. Okay, but I can continue on, but like, come on, guys. That's so perfect, right? And the Lord was like, oh, I pro he keeps telling me like, no, you're going to have lots, lots of provision. And then he started telling me like the Holy Grail. And then a video accidentally came up on my feed and it just played on its own. And as soon as I started hearing it, I knew it was a message from the Lord. So I just waited and watched. And it was a message that was almost like, the video was like an hour and 40 minutes, but the message was about an hour long. Like, like the God just sat there and taught me 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 and then gave me revelation as they were talking. And I'm just like, whoa, man, this is how much is like coming in. But, um, I gotta let you guys go, but this is something I wanted to show you guys. There's more to come. Like the Lord is doing some amazing things right now. Um, he's, he's. I pray, I pray it's time to go and he's going to take us up guys very soon. And, um, I just, I love you guys so much and just know, just have faith in him, have patience. And if you can't just keep starting your day over and somehow the enemy just keeps knocking you down, like, Oh, Oh, I'm failing. I'm not perfect type thing. Just let it go. You know, let it go and relax. Something's going to happen on the 17th. I don't know what it is. I think today's two moon day, but I'm not a hundred percent. Um, but I do know that today, um, we're going to let the kids ride on a train. I don't know if the train's going to be there. I believe it is, but, um, uh, but that, that's like what I'm doing. And so the Lord usually speaks through that, but I believe the 17th is something big, something big. But I also wanted, oh yeah, I also wanted to say is on that card that said, Yoho, the hope. And I knew the Lord said, Yoho, your blessed hope. And Hollister's been asking for a yo-yo over and over and over. And finally, I like made the connection as he wrote it on his list. You, you, a you, yo-ho or something like that. It was spelled out the same way as the card. But then also it says your birthday, you're going to have a huge adventure. Happy birthday. Or, or like your, your big day is going to be a huge adventure. And my birthday is December 30th. So, um, I just want to let you guys know that it's like, it's like right, um, at the turn of the day. And so, um, it's almost like New Year's, you know, and the Lord yelled at me in a dream. He was like, Rosh Hashanah. And then in one of them, I was coming back down from the heavens and being placed back down to earth with wedding invitations. And then in another one, I remembered I was being raptured, but I don't remember the dream. And in the Yuhu dream, I don't remember the dream, but I remember Yuhu and how excited I was. And I think it was the same dream, but I had it twice. The Lord was like, kind of, I don't know. I don't know. I believe it was the same dream. I think I had two rapture dreams. I didn't get to remember it at all. Which I don't know why. I've I've had other dreams that are like represent that. Where I represent like a rescue and stuff. But not really like a rapture going up in the air type thing. So uh, just coming back down. But um, but you guys this time frame for that is just so perfect. Because um, I was paralyzed in fear in that from that series of dreams. I was paralyzed in fear on the couch. And I went into an open vision. Like all of a sudden. That's exactly what I've been doing going through I've been like on and off on and off paralyzing fear it feels like I don't know what because there's just so much ahead that the Lord has promised me that's going to happen hold on I'm doing a video one second I'm getting off here no, I'm getting off here one moment I love you guys so much I'll talk to y'all later